Over a few mountains from here you have Bologna. And in Bologna they made this mistake of cutting out the individual muscles. This was in 1550, yes? But this was what we did with our scalpel, is we isolated out each individual muscle and we said, what would this muscle do if it was the only muscle on the skeleton? The skeleton is stable and the muscles move the skeleton working through tendons over joints that are shaped in such a way that the joint can only move in particular ways. And you can learn a lot from just studying muscles. All I did was take the scalpel and turn it sideways. But ladies and gentlemen, look. We have been trying to understand our body in terms of 600 muscles. But I'm telling you, there's only one muscle. There is one mind. There is one muscle. It is in 600 fascial pockets. But it's one muscle. The brain doesn't have any representation of the deltoid at all. The brain represents the deltoid as one, two, three, four, five, six, seven different muscles going along. And it's a multipennate muscle, and it has seven neuromuscular units that go there. So you don't think of the deltoid in your brain, you think of the seven neuromuscular units. And even there, you only put off some of the fibers in each unit each time. So I'm sorry to do this to you because you have spent a lot of time learning about the muscles. All your learning of the muscles was in vain because you're going to have to forget it. <laughs>